Today uh, we are reviewing the first season of the hit new series, Heroes. Anyway, I'm a huge, huge fan of Heroes. In fact, I was just down in San Diego at Comic-Con where I got to meet and spend some time with Siler. So you was... didn't meet him. You were just in the same room with him during a Q&A session with 5,000 other people. Yeah, it was like we were alone. Okay, so, so if you could be any one of the heroes, who would you be? I would be Siler because he, he can harness other people's abilities. Therefore, his potential is limitless, right? So you'd choose to be evil. No, I would not choose. Yes, I would I would choose to be evil because chicks dig evil. So. Well, what if you could only choose between two superpowers? All right. Invisibility or the cheerleader's power to heal? Invisibility. All the better to check out certain cheerleaders' ability to heal. <laughs> you know what I mean? Do you know what I mean? What if you were trapped in a cage full of lions and tigers? Yeah, invisible. Covered in meat sauce. Invisible, because then I would just lick off the meat sauce, saving myself from those hungry beasts, and then I would also have some tasty meat sauce. Lighter mind reading. Are you? Is that really? Is that a question? Mind reading. Flying is like the most yuppie of the superpowers. It's like the the BMW 3 Series of the superpowers. It's like the the, the beaten goat cheese salad of superpowers. Lester's not impressed with flying. All right, if you can fly out there, I'm not impressed with you. Now, Anna, your turn. Superpower. What would it be? Anna. I would give myself a six-foot tongue with the agility of a jungle cat and the power of a jet engine. Wow, that's strong. Oh, you have no idea. Where are you off to? Where are you off to now? You wanna grab a 